Hello everybody, I'm G2G and welcome back to this tutorial series and in today's episode I am going to show you how to be able to convert coal into diamond when the item stack get exploded. So let's go into the coding. So we're still inside the wormhole plugin and as you can see from the last episode with the uh, iron and coal into diamond combining we are also going to add the explosion conversion. So what we are going to do is we are going to create an event handler. And it's not the uh, event handler I'd expect it to use. Because uh, an item is actually an extension of an entity. So I thought that uh, when the item exploded it was like an entity death event. But that didn't work. So I had to make a, a little workaround uh, around that. And I did it with, so we're going to call the method, of course, on item explode. And I did it with entity explode event. And that is when um, the, uh, the TNT explodes. So not when an entity explodes in, uh, yeah, in a way of getting killed by an explosion. No, when it really explodes. So uh, when TNT explodes. And what we are going to do with that is uh, one of my favorite methods is uh, look at the nearby entity. So get entity, they'll get nearby entities and just a, a radius of about two around the entity will do fine for an explosion. And just below, uh, just the same below over there, you're going to check if and instance of item. So that is the item stack entity. So when you drop an item stack, uh, an item entity gets created. And of course, as you saw, I'm going to just quickly create an item uh, and cast it to item. That way we can work with it a bit easier. And what I'm going to check is if item, and that's the entity, so we need to get the item stack, dot get item stack, dot get type, dot equals material dot call. Then of course I'm going to change it into diamond. But inside of the explosion, the original item stack actually gets destroyed so what we are going to do is we are going to make a new item stack kind of call it drop equals item dot get item stack but that will just give us like a reference so we need to clone it it's a bit weird but now we make like a copy of the item stack we have the original which is the one that gets destroyed and now we have this one which is like a clone of that other one what I'm just going to do is set type material dot diamond. And of course you can do many things with this. You can check for other types of materials over here. You can combine it with the combiner. So when an item gets exploded, it looks in a certain direction, uh, a certain radius if there's any other items and then combines them or whatever you like. So drop dot set type material dot diamond. And of course the entity dot get world dot drop item. Then we are going to do end dot get location. And the item is going to be the drop. And that's actually it. You've seen it on the server already at the beginning of the episode. So I'm not going to show it again. And that's it for today's episode. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you got any feedback or suggestions, down below the comment section. Or in the description box, you will find a link to the Discord channel. There's about almost 100 people. Still a little too short. Let's get it to 100. Hope to see you over there. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.